In the meantime, I would like to connect you to an etheric healing chamber located inside the inner earth in a place called Avalon. Take a moment to allow yourself to breathe fully through the heart space. When you take your deep breath in, I ask that you fully connect it to and guide it towards your heart. And then hold it for as long as you can hold it. And then when you breathe out, let go of anything that may be bothering you at this time or anything that's on your mind. So take a deep breath in. And breathe out. Take a deep breath in. And breathe out. Take a deep breath in and breathe out. Now I would like you to think of a time when you felt fully and completely loved unconditionally. Or when you gave love fully and completely without any conditions. Hold this memory inside your heart. Hold this feeling that you feel. Allow it to fill up your heart space. Now I would like to ask you to send this love, this feeling that you have inside your heart out to somebody who you feel needs this love right now. Now send it all the way out over your community, over the town or the city that you live in. Watch this blanket of love go all over the area, all around the people that live in your community. Now, we're going to send this love all the way around the globe of our blue planet, the blue globe that we call Gaia. Send that love all the way, allow it to surround and blanket the earth. Now, I ask you to send this love all the way out to the cosmos, to the, all of the planets that exist outside of our Earth and even our universe, places that you wouldn't even know existed. Send this love all the way to the cosmic heart of the universe. Now, send this love fully all the way up to the great central sun. 
all the way up past the great central sun where the creator source resides. The creator source is here and the creator source would like to fill you up with the love the creator source has for you. Allow this love to fully and completely fill up your body and your etheric light body. Just take it in. You are fully and completely loved. There is nothing you could ever do or say that would make it so that you would not be able to accept this love. The Creator Source loves every single aspect of you and all of its creations. There is nothing you could ever do to be abandoned by this creator source. Notice there is a tunnel in front of you. This tunnel is a dark purple indigo bluey dark color and it is filled with little light stars and orbs allow yourself to enter the tunnel just as slight as you would if it was it looks to me like a water slide and allow yourself to slide in through the portal that's going to take you all the way down deep into the inner earth to a place called Avalon slide all the way down and as you come to the bottom you land in an area that is inside a forest and you notice that everything seems to glow inside of this forest plants and the trees and there's insects and bugs and there's one that's kind of floating around you that looks like a jellyfish but it's not it's a, t it's a little thing floating around in the air and it comes down and it allows you when you put your hand out to land on your hand There's an inner earth being that approaches you. She is very tall and her skin is kind of a little bit of a hint of blue but it seems to be all lit up. She's full of light and she's wearing a shimmery white silvery type of clothing she is one of the inner earth beings and she wants to take you into a city of light So as she puts her hand out to you, 
and reaches towards you. Allow yourself to hold her hand and she will escort you into the Avalon City of Light. As you get closer into the city, you notice that there's all these huts that seem to be all over the area. Some are up in the trees and some are down on the ground. And they are made of some kind of material that looks like they're see-through. They're domed shaped huts. And they look like they're see-through, but yet when you look inside, they're full of light. But when you look through them, you don't see anything inside. And so they seem to be like a double-sided mirror, so you cannot see. So the people that are inside, they have their own privacy. And this being takes you over to what she says is one of the many healing pools that are located inside of here. She beckons you to allow yourself to go down into the healing pool. And as you walk into the healing pool, she comes over and she assists you with a cleaning ritual. There are potions on the side of the pool that look like they're potions, but they're actually healing balms and salves and oils. And she takes a loofah and she washes you and explains that we're washing you to prepare you to go into your healing chamber. There is a need to allow the denseness of the earth plane where you have been living and residing to be washed off before you go into the healing chamber. She also explains that this is something that you can also do even in your shower to consciously cleanse yourself and your auric field with the water as it falls down around you. Or fill your bathtub up with Epsom salts and allow yourself to have a lovely salt, salt bath regularly. So now you're all washed and ready to go. She puts a nice white fluffy robe around of you and starts to escort you out of the healing pool. In front of you is a domed, it's not a dome, it's a pyramid shaped building that looks to be like it's made out of crystal. She shows you that to enter this there is no door that you just allow yourself to walk through the wall. She does so by putting her leg and arm into it and beckons you to do the same. You find yourself inside the pyramid and there is a crystal bed laid out in the middle of the room. And 
there is a nice white fluffy mattress on top of the crystal bed and beautiful hand woven soft blankets and pillows. Allow yourself to get onto the bed and cover yourself up with a blanket and get yourself comfortable if you wish. The Lemurian Star Mothers are here and they're inside the room and they're just getting things ready. Inside this lovely healing chamber, you notice all of a sudden that it starts to change colors. And it is explained by the Lemurian Star Mothers and your spiritual teams that when you're inside the healing chamber, your team will give you an etheric body scan and assess what it is that you need today. Every time you come to the healing chamber, you will need something different. And then they start putting light infusion that's coming out of their hands and they start massaging you and your auric field with energy and light infusion. Today it's the color green. When they want when they want to tell you that when they're using the color green, it usually means that you need some sort of healing some sort of help in your physical body. And when the color green comes on, this is what they're doing. And now they're showing me the color blue. And they're wanting me to tell you that when they bathe you in the, the, the blue ray, that usually they're bringing forward truth and information. keys and codes to help you work through information in your mind. When they bring on the color red or pink They're working with your chakras, your base chakra. But when they're bringing on the pink, they're working with your heart. When they're bringing on the color yellow, they're working with your solar plexus. 
So what they're trying to explain is when they bring on the different colors of the rainbow, it corresponds with the chakra that is needing help or adjustment. And just sit with the energies that they give to you. And trust that you will be given exactly what you need. They want you to know that you can come to these healing chambers anytime you wish. You can come when you're in pain and when you need to have some help and readjustment with the physical pain. And you can also come when you just feel like you need some rejuvenation and some rest. Or when you simply feel like you just need to come and be with them. A lot of you are on missions to help raise the vibration of the planet. And you're surrounded by very dense beings that bring your vibration down. Whenever you want to raise your vibration and be just be with a higher vibration. Allow yourself to come to this healing chamber. All you need to do is just say out loud, please bring me to the healing chamber today, either in meditation or even before you go to sleep at night. And your spiritual team will always be there to help adjust, recalibrate, and infuse you with whatever light you need. And sometimes you will be infused with keys and codes to help you with your missions. We want to tell you that you always have these keys and codes inside of you and that we can't turn anything on that isn't already lying dormant inside of yourself. So just know that when you come to us And we're just turning it back on for you. When the time is right. So today, what we're going to do is we're going to spin the bed that you are laying on. And as we spin the bed, Metatron is here. And Metatron has some sacred geometry that he would like to give to you. Some symbols. So as the bed spins, the symbols are dropped in to your solar plexus. These are symbols of creation, creativity. Take these symbols
and go out there and use them for good. It is time now to leave the healing chamber. We want you to know you can come back anytime you wish. We thank all of the guides that helped us here today. When you're ready, wiggle your fingers and toes and open your eyes.